Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, thank you for joining. So today we're gonna do a video that is makeup, a full face of makeup, $6 and under. So I do have a few things that I have already in my collection and we're just gonna do a full face of makeup, $6 and under. So I'm gonna go ahead and prime my eyelids here. I'm gonna go ahead and blend out the eyelids. All right, so then I do have this Wet n Wild palette. This is the Walking on Eggshells palette. So this is the Wet n Wild palette that I'm gonna be using today. So I do see they have a couple transition colors in here as well. So we're just gonna use those. And I'm just gonna take a little fluffy brush here and just dip into this uh, tan color here as a transition color. I'm going to take this um, dark brown color right here. I'm going to put this at the edge of my eye here. So I'm just going with it. I don't know what we're creating. I'm just going with it. I don't like rehearse or anything like that. I just pull out a palette and just start, you know, playing around to see what I can create. So I'm just gonna take this cream color here, this light cream color, and I'm just gonna put that on the front of my eye here. So just tap it on there. Just pile it on top of that other eyeshadow. That way it stays, because if you just put it on like regular eyeshadow, then it's going to just smear over a little bit. It's gonna blend all together. So you can start like you're putting on regular eyeshadow, and then once you get it placed down, then just pack it. spray my brush and then I'm going to use that pink and maybe just put it like on top and see what it creates. So this is the LA Girl um, Very Black Eyeliner, and I know this is under $5. Um, everything that I have is pretty much under $6. The only thing that was $6 is the foundation that I'm going to use in today's video. So I'm going to go ahead and put on my eyeliner here. I know I was trying to do it the other way, but it's just not happening, so... And do what works for you, whatever techniques and things that you do, you know, that fits you, do what works for you. 
we're all aging anyway. It ain't gonna hurt me to pull on my eye. If that's how I'm comfortable doing it, then that's what we're gonna do. So that's what I'm doing today. All right, so the eyeliner is on. And then I'm gonna go ahead and put on some lashes. I'm gonna put on the lashes that I had bought from Timu because they are under $5. Um, I will leave the Kiss lashes that I have. I think those are over, they're probably like $10, $12, something like that. So I'm just gonna go ahead and use the Timu lashes and put those on. All right, so lashes are on. So I must say that did bring the look together for me. Um, so lashes are on. So now we're gonna go ahead and prep the face. Get started. So I'm just using my Believe Beauty Master at Matte Makeup Setting Spray. Okay, and then we have the e.l.f. Uh, Grip Primer. Um, this is the Power Grip Primer. I know this was like under, this is like, I think it was like $5. Um, and you can get that at Walmart. So I'm just going to put this on here. Put this on my finger. Just a little bitty amount here. And it's going to make your makeup stick. So that's good. I'm just going to rub it in here. So I do have two colors of foundation because it seems that I can't find my perfect match in e.l.f. Um, but this one is um, Cashew. So that's what this one looks like right here. And then we have um, Caramel. So that's Caramel right there. So we have those two colors. Of course, one is darker than the other, but I'm going to go ahead and put it on. And we're going to go ahead and create this look here. So I'm going to shake it up. So we're just gonna mix them. And I'm just gonna do like one pump of each. And then I'm just gonna mix it on my hand here, on the back of my hand and just create my shade. And as you can see, it's like almost perfect. So we're going to go ahead and put the foundation on. And again, I just used one pump and blend the colors in. I'm just going to take me a little foundation brush here. So the shade may be a little bit light, but it could also be the lighting too, but um, it looks pretty, it looks pretty. And I would say this is like medium coverage, medium to full coverage, I'm sure you can build it up. But from what I'm seeing, you know, it's like medium coverage. It's buildable, so. All right, so I'm going to take my concealer now. Of course, I have the um, e.l.f. concealer and I have the shade Tan Walnut. So I'm just gonna use this and put this under my eyes. All right, so now that the concealer has set in, we're gonna go ahead and blend it out. So I like to let my concealer sit for a couple minutes just to let it, you know, marinate on your skin. 
and then we'll blend it out. And from looking at the concealer, it looks like it may be just a little bit darker than my skin tone, but that's okay. We'll go ahead and blend it in. What I like to do is if I have any like acne, then I'll just take that same concealer brush and just like, you know, dabble over it and conceal it. So we're gonna let this sit and then we'll blend this back out and move on for the rest of the face. All right, so now that the concealer has sit in, we're getting ready to um, blend it out with the setting powder. For the setting powder, I'm going to use the e.l.f. Halo Glow Setting Powder. And this one is in the shade, I believe this one is, okay, this one's medium. So this is medium, it's like a tan color. So remember, the trick is for the concealer to set your under eyes Push down on your under eyes with your brush or a sponge, whatever you choose to use, and, and then you set the under eyes. So I'm doing that and then immediately taking my setting powder brush, and again, this is real techniques, and just applying it under my eyes. Looking up, setting it under my eyes. Now I'm going to take my other setting powder, which is from Timu. Um, this one's in Honey as well. I'm just gonna take this one here and apply it on my face. This set my face. And yes, it is under $5 or under $6. The only thing that was $6, I believe, is that foundation from e.l.f. So that, now we're gonna do um, bronzer, blush, and highlight, but we're gonna go ahead and set the face because we put all the powders on, now we're gonna set the face. All right, so for the bronzer, I'm going to use the Wet n Wild Contour Palette Contour. It doesn't say what shade this is in, so I'm gonna go ahead and use it as a bronzer. So I'm gonna use this color here. I'm just gonna go in with this color here. Just take it. And bring some color back to my skin. I have used this before in the Dollar General review. Um, this one is in Amore. So they do have a blush and a highlighter, but I already have a different highlighter that I'm gonna use. Although this would go, I could mix highlighters, I guess, but this uh, color is really pretty. So that's the color right there. All right, so that's the blush. And then I think I'm going to mix my highlighters here. So I'm actually, and I'm gonna amp it up a little bit. This time I'm gonna mix it up and I'm gonna amp up the highlighter. So I'm gonna dip my brush into both highlighters. I have this other highlighter, which is from Wet n Wild. Um, this one is Potray. So I'm going to dip my brush into the Believe Beauty highlighter and then I'm gonna dip my brush in here into the Wet n Wild one as well. So I'm just gonna mix shades, dip and spray. So I just sprayed it. You see, see how pretty that is? Mm 
I think that's really pretty. And again, I like to take my highlight and just put it up by my brow bone and just put that on there because it makes it, it makes it pop. So there's that. And I would never wear this much blush and highlighter in public, but for the sake of the video, I did put it on so you guys could see the color. So I'm going to take this um, pink color right here that we have. I'm gonna dip and spray and put this on my lower lash line. This isn't popping the way I want it to pop. So I think what I'm gonna do is take that Believe Beauty highlighter or the, yeah, the highlighter and put that on my lower lash line. So I'm gonna do that instead. So I'm just taking a pencil brush, dipping into it, spraying my brush here, and see what we can create. So we're gonna use this Essence Lash Princess because this is under $5. I believe it was like $4.49 on Amazon. So we're gonna use this, of course, my favorite Holy Grail mascara. And we're gonna do the lower lashes. So we have some finishing powder from Wet n Wild. This shade looks kind of light, but I'm still gonna rock it anyway. It's a, you know, it goes with the video. Um, but yeah, the shade's kind of light. It's in medium tan. So that's the color there. So, I mean, if you're like me and you fade in the winter, this may work for you right now, but we'll see. I'm gonna go ahead and put it on. All right, so now we're gonna go ahead and put on the lipstick. Well, it's a lip stain from e.l.f. And I do have mine in the color Basic Beige. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this on. I do have my clear gloss on because I don't like putting anything on my lips that are just dry. I think it makes your lips look really dry. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this on over top. Yeah, it's a really pretty color. And this completes the video. Um, I will be having more reviews. I'm gonna have more content. I'm about to push them out, so be prepared. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. There's more content coming. If you like videos like this, don't miss it. So as always, I'll see you in my next video. Stay blessed.